Professor Eric. Gonna do some JKD. JKD. JKD, Kali, Wing Chun mm -hmm. ish stuff. So I did the uh, Bilgy cycle. That's right. With the, the with the parry and the wedge, and that is a traditional Wing Chun sensitivity drill. So under the Kali umbrella, which is just like okay, it's in Asano kind of doing Wing Chun. So basically, he would take a structure and like, how can I break it? Mm -hmm. Or how can I bend the rule and get what I want? Because sometimes, like me center line versus you center line, uh, we're kind of at a stalemate here. I don't really have the advantage trying just to crash in. Mm -hmm. But if I angulate, then mm -hmm. I have an advantage, right? So this is just a drill to get you to switch side to side. The other thing it does is think about the context of like the 60s. Wing Chun is the superior technology because what's the most common martial art in the 60s and 70s? Karate. Karate. People, boxing was looked down upon. Mm -hmm. Like, oh, you're just a boxer? Like, everybody wanted to be like ninjas, wear the headband, be in the movies, right? So if you think about, we're doing karate, and you do a low jab. Yeah, right here. If you punch low, that's the answer. So then if we trap and hit, it works all day. But now, like post nineteen ninety, everybody's like MMA yeah, yeah. structure. We're like this. So you're like, well, one, how am I even getting to the lead arm? Yep. Let alone, how am I getting all the way to the rear arm? Mm -hmm. okay. and, and we'll do some setups. I personally prefer the split entry to trap both hands because mm -hmm. even right if his there. guard is just yeah. up, just splitting it now, all the trapping is available. You don't have to work as hard. I don't think, in my opinion, right? Everything can come off the split entry. Well, we're gonna start with the outside preference because again, we're just doing a drill. So from here, all I'm gonna do is just pox out duck, and he's gonna cover. So because he naturally covered on the first one, all I'm gonna do is angle and shuffle. And I should be able to touch center, but he's gonna correct it. Correct. And now we've started the drill. So this is just like last week, if you guys remember. But I'm gonna go pox out, elbow, and backhand, and you're gonna block this one. So now I'm gonna re-replace. I'm gonna do female triangle footwork on the exchange. So when this foot steps up, now my left hand goes. And I'm gonna go pock, elbow, backhand. So we call this the wedge drill. That's it. So pock, elbow, backhand. So is it Wing Chun? This piece kind of is, but then elbow and backhand and the angulation has a lot of Kali influence. Yeah, so all he's doing is waiting for the backhand, and I'm moving around. But I really want this loaded, and uh, we can start to play a game where I really try to like find the center, and my partner tries to stop me from getting to the center. Oh, and sometimes in stopping, see the inside route will be open, because now that person has to choose between like mm -hmm. parrying to this side or going outward. Yep. And that's it. So basic wedge drill, let's do from this side. Hmm. So I just start off, he can be left or right lead, it doesn't really matter. I did the left lead last time, so I'll do it again. So I pock and hit. So my left leg is in front, so on the first one, I just take an angulated shuffle, okay? And then, boom, make a step and slide, you block that one. Then I rear replace, and as my left foot goes, that's the timing of the hand. I don't want two hands in here, yeah. right? So one, two, shift. So the reality is going to be hit, yeah. it's going to be moving like that. As soon as I hit, you're going to take a walk. That's it. Just like uh, if we isolate the footwork, you see people in class, right? And they're like, cool, I'm doing yeah, it. Just going like this. I'm doing it. This is good. I do this around my house. But it's really like when you're going to go, you're yeah. going to, you have to have a little bit of athleticism to do martial arts. Like, I hate to tell you that. True. Just, but it's true. Man. It helps. It helps. Yeah. But to really pull it off, you have to be able to get that quick step off of them. Yep. You know? yeah. And I can take that step because when do I switch my feet? When it's next to right here. Like yeah, when feet. it's loaded, that's when you can switch your feet. Yeah. And then I'll help out your boxing too. Mm -hmm. After, or like in Thai boxing, a common thing to do is to go straight right, switch kick. Yep. But you see a lot of people go straight right, switch, yep. and I'm just floating in the air. Yeah. But the better thing to do is connect and then take the switch kick off of it that way. Yeah, sure. And it works 10 times better more often. And you don't just get pushed. Yeah, you don't, you're, like, you're an astronaut for a yep. minute if you just 
Oh yeah, funny. I've seen him like just launch people <laughs> when they when they do this. Like, yeah, I mean, I did that. Type one do as a yeah, kid. Yeah. That when we were always full here. When you look for it, and it's just so apparent. When you don't, yeah. when you don't understand to look for it. I can see how you get away with it, but when you like learn how to look for it, you're just you're just asking to just get hit. Yeah. And you're like, hey, wait, which left kick am I gonna do? <laughs> <laughs> it's just not very. It's not a really good tactic. But. So it should become fun on the other side too. Yeah. Once you cultivate it, then you know what to look for. Yeah. Because you always reverse engineer mm -hmm. it. Absolutely. And then you're like, oh, I remember I used to do that. Boom. And yeah. I that. Yeah. Anyway, yeah. pretty fun. So that's the Kali wedge drill. If you're new to trapping, I would start just pock so da, work on lop sow, work on double pock on the inside, then cultivate the bilgey cycle that we did a week or two ago. My days are blurry. Too many classes. Yeah, yeah I hear you. Man. Right on, guys. Thanks for watching. Right, if you haven't yet, like and subscribe to the channel. Absolutely. And we'll be back with something cool, I'm yep, sure. We'll figure it out. We All got right. something awesome for you. Warriors? Warriors out.